Welcome back everybody. Today I'm with Grid Runner again and we've come to check out his planet and a couple of his ships. So I'm just going to sort of mosey over here. And uh, in fact I think I'll park at a safe distance and take the shroom copter in. So here we go. Yep. Hey everyone. Okay. So I'm in the ship, in my copter. Let's see if I can... Uh, oh where are you mate? Oh there you are. Oh, well first of all, what are you in? What's this? It's a little custom fighter that I've built for um, my battle station that I'm building here. Oh, that's come, nice. Come around here, I've actually got a couple docked in here. Oh, okay. Or you can go down into the main shaft with it. Let's have a look. Oh! <laughs> it's currently in the build. You can see there's a couple of ships in there. Oh, it's not open for me. That's weird. Really? Yeah, that's weird. Look. Oh, wait, there we go. Right, you know, let me have a look. That's my door. That's my door. <laughs> well, I'll go and open the other side because you little can space actually, walks. There's actually a, there's a big door here. Well, I just want to make sure everyone gets a good look at it. You know, look at that. That looks great. Obviously, it's a working program. Oh, you got more, right? I'm going to come catch up with you, mate. There's a lot to look at. You can see the positioning of the hull and the use of wedges, and then obviously we've got a bit of crystal and lava in use from the engine there. I love that. That looks great. Bring it back a bit. It looks a little bit better from the distance now. I'm just want to fire it up. There we go. My uh, AI turrets seem to be moving, so. Yeah, there must be some pirates. They've probably pwned them already. Oh, and you're going underneath. Okay, so let's see where you've gone. Ooh, yeah, so what's the name of your. Uh, this ship in here? It's just uh, like a little scarab fighter. I haven't really named it. Yep. I love the way you've built the dock in here. I mean, I've seen it in various stages of being built, but there's a lot going on in here, which you, uh... Yeah, let's have a look around the rest of the ship. So we were at the back, so we'll come around to the side now. These turrets are great. So here we are, coming along the side. These are actually more lasers on the side there. Nice. Thanks, lasers. There's so many weapons on this. I love the use of hull pattern in here, this is great. Big fan. It's great. And we've got some bigger turret with like big blasters. I wanted it to make <laughs> cannons. It, so it's got two nice fat bits of shielding on the top and the bottom. Yeah. You know, heavily armoured and heavily powered and tried to make it look as organic as I possibly could. I wanted to almost look a bit lizard like. Back up this way. Use of lighting there. The, wedges anyway. the wedge pattern is really nice. It does give it an organic feel. Um, it's alive. It's alive. I'm trying to make it feel like that. I mean, from where I'm, where I am now. If you can look at it from this angle, you can see there's so much going on. I didn't really want to make it fully symmetrical either. Little ships as well. Let's take a look at the top. Air, airlock facility. Could you open that door again? Really? Yay, I'm in. No problem opening the doors. Yeah. So Have I got, got yeah, I got gravity, gravity beautiful. Control. Yeah, we are with gravity. So this is a little airlock. Yep. Start the ship. The ship is quite large inside. You may get lost. Wow, look at that. Straight through the door. No. <laughs> okay, so then we have I may need to shut all of the doors. Yeah, all of the doors open. This actually is a little gravity elevator. Yep. You come through here and it takes you up. If we go up, it takes you up into another little. Yep. This is the separate area for the um, gun turret for somebody else to man. So we hit the gravity here again and go through this door here. And as you can see, you're now actually up in the top turret. You've got a nice little window. Ah, you. I see. You can see both the ships out there through the window. Yeah. And if we want to, we can shut the blast doors. Oh, yep. Go ahead. I actually did them, but for some reason, yours it's is lagging. Not catching it's just a bit of lag. It's all good. 
So, yeah, you know, interestingly, I actually put water in there because um, I didn't want to have a separate glass. Yeah, it, it looks it nice. It does look better. It does. And then if anybody wishes to, they can jump in the weapons computer here and you actually have control of the weapons. Although, well, for some reason, it's a bit buggy at the moment. I've got a pulse just, computer. I've just been f***ed <laughs> out. Yeah, look at that. Uh, I haven't configured the pulse system very well. Oh, it looked great. It was great. new to me and... Um, I'm going to shoot it again. It doesn't do very much. It's reloading. That was fun. So. Oh no, I'm outside. Yeah, same thing. Help me! <laughs> I'm in gravity as well. <laughs> okay, I'm heading back to the airlock. Yeah. Okay. Onwards. So, so that's a unique little uh, thing for somebody else to do. So here we come to our next gravity elevator. We're going down, so we'll just drop straight down. Cool. Nice. And into the first of many corridors. I love the lighting in all your corridors. They're great. It's great. This green is just all green. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, great. a lot of the rooms have not been decked out yet. That's okay. Every, the, every bit of space is filled, though. The only open space is the space you see. Yeah. Everything behind is completely filled with power and you know all of your usual shields and things like that. I have some good ideas. The thing is, I just didn't really want to rush it. Yeah. I want to take my time, and uh, it's taken me quite a long time to build the ship. But this is uh, a room I'm working on at the moment. Cool. As you can see, there are separate little containment rooms here. This would like be that. like uh, some kind of medical facility or something. And when you build everything by hand, it takes quite a long time. Mm, yeah. Some of the rooms I've done it. Oh. Okay, so, what's next? Uh, da, 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 da. There are many more rooms here, but I think the best thing for us to do, because I actually haven't done anything more to this floor, I don't think. Right. Let's go have a look. No. Yeah? Okay. So, if we just... Go in. Gravity on. Okay, and now we can fly down to the floor here. All the doors are open. Oh, you went straight past. I'm okay. <laughs> Uh, mainly For here, the there, there's just two rooms, uh, two gravity elevators, and then this room Ooh, here. This which, is very nice. Which looks out over the, the other ship in the end. Uh, oh wow, it looks out over your dock. Yeah, this um, this goes on for a few floors, like three different levels of this. So if we go down to the next one, we can arrive this. Whoa, fall to the bottom. I'm with you. So if we can... To this room. Yep. While well, the doors are open, we have a little control room here, and again, there's some detail going on. But again, you can look straight out over the uh, bay and see what's in bay. there, which is sweet. Observation control yeah, room. Observation control room. Yeah, yeah. it's great. I love it. Over here. <coughs> we go down here. We have a little computer facility room going on. Awesome. Computers. Computers, computers everywhere. I'll show you the engine rooms. There's an engine room on either side of the ship and the actual engines. Nice. Where they should be. So, anyway, let's go out of the computer room. That, cool. room, that room's actually finished. So nice. That. that was real nice. I like the computer stacks, you know, like yeah. tower, big towers. <laughs> I've opened all of the doors when uh, you can now do it when you're in the control room. Structure you? tab, yeah. So, I'm opening that door. And this brings us into uh, storage area. Storage, and this is meant to be like a little teleportation bay, if you like. Oh wow, yeah, transporters. Uh -huh. so. Get kitted up and beam down. And then we have the lower control deck. Oh, very nice. It's like, yeah. Oh wow, you go. Oh wow, you finished it. Look at that. It, okay, guys. So this is probably the first time I've actually seen <clears throat> a, a bridge which has got. You know, corridors with computers all the way around. You've got central pillars. That's a really cool concept. No one's done well, that. This is the lower bridge. This is like engineering, if you like. Yeah. <laughs> right. So, what? This is a, this is like a backup or engine. This is this engineering. Is like the engineering bridge. Yeah. Wow, this so, isn't even the bridge. No. Still, because it, the way that you have to go around, you know, it just makes it feel that does it feels more like, because everyone, a lot of people do an open plan. You know, big open plan. 
so it's more to see down this way, so it's coming yeah. over to the engine rooms. Again, this is like uh, more engineering. <laughs> it's a nice style for the control panels and things. And it's nice, and you've got some power cores going on there. So if we come through here, we can better shut this door. Okay. So now we're in the actual main dock. <laughs> oh, it looks so much bigger when you're actually in here. Can we get up there? Um, on the sides, there's a gravity, there's flex storage, and again, some teleportation sort of style. Oh yeah, yeah, teleporters. Yeah. So, if we come back through the I'm just going to have a look at the roof quick. So you were talking about it quickly. Look at that. That's an interesting feature there. There's a bit random block in the place there. Huh. Just take out that block from there. Where? Go up. Classic. So there it is. I like the detailing on the wall you've got as well. It's it's nice, it breaks up big flat open spaces, you know? Yeah, well, I wanted it to make it feel like it was a little bit alive, you know? It's yeah. Like it's ribs, almost. Right, I'm so this is again, this is the same as the other side, just for everyone watching, that we just looked at. We've got a little bit of detail. So I'm gonna head up. Oh yeah, very nice. Just got an empty room there at the moment. Uh, so anyway, it's the engine, it's the main engine room. Oh out. yeah, this is gonna be good. Oh yeah. Okay, so you can look see. At it. You can see through the glass there. Yeah, I'm looking. Having, having a look. Once you open that door, you are. Oh, they're all off for some reason. What no, they're on on my screen, mate. Don't worry. It's on fine mind. on mine. For the purposes of the video, it looks fine. Look at this. It's beautiful. As you're going through it, it all looks like there's a glow. It stages through. They're all on for me. Look at that. Like Spark! Plasma Spark! Like. <laughs> Get your hands out of there! <laughs> this looks great. This is a really effective design. In fact, I might have to copy this. Oh, you're welcome to. It's beautiful. Um, I played around with a lot of design. For actually getting into the core, you know, it's reactor room. It's yeah. beautiful. It's got a great effect moving forward and coming around it. It's beautiful. And I like the way... You that is amazing. Oh, should we get to the bridge then? Yeah. Take control of the ship. This is where we get lost. Oh, I know where I'm going now. Where are you going? You are following me, or should be. I'm following you, yeah. Okay, so we are at the lower stage. Yep. See, this is the... We're back here. This is a different window. There's oh, three is it? windows going So this yeah. is the other end. Oh, yeah, this is the bottom. I think I did take a little quick peek when I was following you the other way. So we'll go straight up. Yeah. Yep. 